Hey guys, what's going on? Hayden here from our Pokemon Snakewood Nuzlocke. So in the last episode, we ended up reaching uh, Lily Cove City. We took on the Deadly Seven last time. Uh, and they were actually quite a threat. But um, here we are, here's the team, and apparently there's something in this house that... Um, if you go through that door, you're giving yourself up for dead, so... I think something big is coming up in this house, so let's see what's going on. Chloe! What's the meaning of this? Everyone's trying to kill me! Hmm, of course you've served your purpose. You got rid of the horsemen for us. Now since you're a threat to our government, prepare to die. Guards! Seems like everyone's against us. Damn it, I can't take you all on like this for another two generations. Now destroy him. Hold it right there. Whoa, what the fuck? This seems like a little unfair, don't you think? Three people against one? And with zombie backup? What say you, zom uh, Dragon Vis Visigoth? I concur, Dragon Hun. Shall we take on these buffoons? I believe we should. As for His Majesty's commands, Hayden, you take down this woman. We, we shall hold off these fools. And the TV's slashing over there, I see that, so something's going on on the TV. Holy shit, the yin-yang symbol. Teos Chloe, she's got six Pokemon. She's going to lead off with an Alakazam. That is not a good matchup for Spitty whatsoever. Um, let's go into Square and set up a light screen. It's only level 46, so... I've got, I've got seven level. I've got nine levels on it, rather. Spark is gonna do a boat half. Let's go for a Screech and then a Swift. It's, it's got all them elemental punches. I'm gonna use a Hyper Potion real quick, and I'm going to Swift it. Oh, it doesn't quite kill it. My Light Screen is gonna wear off. That's annoying. I'm gonna wake myself up. She's gonna go for a Full Restore, of course. So I'm gonna set up another Light Screen. I'm going to. Spark, and it's going to paralyze it, but it's also going to paralyze me. Okay, I don't like that. Full Restore. And a Spark. There we go. Two hit kill. Should have just gone for two Sparks in the first place. Persian. Um, let's give someone else some love. Let's go... Um, let's go into Crush. These things are normal and dark, so fighting totally fucks them up. Uh, let's just go for a Vital Throw just to be safe. It's going to break my light screen. Fuck you. Thankfully, it doesn't do that much damage, though. Gengar. Um. Shit. I'm only using, like, these three right now. Boober, Crush, and uh, Square, but. Fuck. Um. Gengar could have Thunderbolt. He could also have Psychic. Sanic can't even touch him. None of my moves will affect him. Even, uh, Ground. Even Sandtune, because he's got fucking, uh, Levitate. Shit. I'm gonna go into square and I'm gonna set up a light screen. It's gonna go for a shadow ball, so that's a physical attack. Gengar has really shitty physical attack, so that's okay. And there we go. Easy kill. Square is almost level 56. Jesus. Face leech. This fucking thing. Okay, I know it uses physical moves, and I know it has really. It's really frail. I think Sanic is gonna be my best bet for this. Because this thing is fast as fuck. Poison Fang does like nothing, and it's gonna die to a slash. Hell yeah. Wigglytuff. Uh, you know what? Let's just stay in. I'm just gonna rock smash it. So that's gonna be a two hit kill. It's gonna put me to sleep, though. That's annoying. So many things put me to sleep. It's gonna body slam and paralyze me. At least it can't put me to sleep now. So I'm just gonna rock smash it. And then Aggron. Um. You know what? Let's go into Crush and just kill it with a fighting move. Let's just go for a cross chop. It's going to miss and it's going to bite me. Iron Slam. That's going to miss. There we go. Fucking finally. Cross chop. Teos Chloe was defeated. Damn it. Alakazam used Teleport. Where did those footmen go? We ate them. But, oh, fuck. And the zombies? Them too. Uh-oh. Dr. Blackthorn conveyed a message to his majesty, then we ordered to come and help you. Please ride my back and we'll take you to Mofty. So we're, oh shit! Fort Draco. The hell? You ought to speak to Meteor, Hayden. Hayden, I'm glad that you arrived safely. Thank you. A thousand times thank you for rescuing my daughter. It was nothing, really. Here, take her back. Thank you again. In return, please take this. HMO2, I think that's actually Fly. Yes, it is. 
By the way, before you leave, you might want to speak to, to Dragon Hunt. He said he would take you some to some interesting places. Oh? Anyway, I must be leaving now. By the way, Hayden, the forces of the East have moved into Lily Cove, looking for you. They're catching up fast, so be wary, understand? Okay. Good. Farewell. So, I can't say anyone on my team can learn fly. Yeah, that's annoying. Um, fuck. Is there a Pokemon Center anywhere? A bunch of dragons everywhere. Pokemon Center. There's one. And oh, of course it's run. It's run by a dragon. So let's see if anyone in my pe do I have anyone alive who can use fly? Uh, can Beedrill fly? I doubt it. Just gonna put Mikargo there for a sec. Oh, he can fly. Okay, that that's good. Um, yeah, you're definitely gonna get fly. Um, y'all get rid of rage. So I'm gonna be okay. So I'm gonna be pulling him out of the computer at various times so I can fly. But I'm, I'm definitely not putting Beedrill on the team. Beedrill fucking sucks. <laughs> so let's explore this place a bit. What do you say? Hey. There's some, something I took from a musky looking human a long time ago. I would like I would like you to have them. Thank you. Wait. We've got the dumbbells. What the fuck? Why do we have dumbbells? Can't be carrying those in my bag. A whole item that promotes growth but reduces Oh, this is a this is the macho brace. Okay. Got caves everywhere. Wait, what? Victory Road. This is a new area. Shit, we can catch something here. And it's a Laron. Okay, I, I think it's actually been a while since we've caught something. Uh, fuck it, let's catch it though. I'm gonna go for a Giga Drain. Of course! So now we don't get something from Victory Road. However, this will be a nice place to level grind. What else can we find here? Hombone, of course we can find Hombones here. This must mean that we're getting close to the end. If we, can, if we can access Victory... Of course, this is just a little portion, but... If we can access Victory Road, then we must be getting close to the end. I think I'm just gonna get Vileplume up to level 53 since he's almost there. I can't believe that, though. I fucking got a critical hit. I've lost... I, I think I've lost multiple encounters now to critical hits, because I think I lost a Shroomish at the beginning of the game. Of course not. Uh, fuck. Yeah. Drain a few more of these Hom Bones. Actually, I'm out of Giga Drains, I think. I'll just go for pe yeah, Pedal Dance. I'll just go for Pedal Dance. And level 53. Yay. Big difference. Alright, so I'm just going to heal off so I can get my Giga Drains back. That's nice, though. I, like, I've got a better place to level grind now, because I was getting fucking sick and tired of level grinding off these like level 35 line names. In these caves, we wait for the Call to War. Oh, Jesus. Let me reward you for freeing the horsemen's... This is a rod carved from the spine of a Kingdra's head, the Lord of the Sea. His power will call forth mighty Pokemon to your aid. So we got the Kingdra rod. Superior to all other rods. Jeez, okay. It's like, is that like the super rod or something? Hmm, not yet. Come back when you've obtained the secret of the Magi. Okay. Jeez, there's, there is shit to do in this town. This tunnel is the sole link between the fort and the outside. That's why there are three of us guarding it here. We're on guard. Okay, so I guess I can come out here. The great enemy that is. Oh, shit. They are encamped in this... Okay, so the great enemy, whoever that is. There's a netball here. That's nice. Uh, I got another cave here. Gee. Oh, hello? It's that Charizard, so that's where it lives. Oh, yeah, we've even seen it. We have saw it in a few places, I think, in this game. This is my Charizard. It gathers information about the region for me. This is weird. Like, there's like, there's like black Charizards here, and then there's a Charizard. I don't know. Oh, endless plains again. The perfect place to get some exercise. So there's a, there's a Meowth, there's a Snorlax, there's a Kecleon, and a Hombone. All right. So let's see. What are you saying? Uh, something about the rock. I don't know. Meteor had us rebuild the Poké Center and Pokémon especially for you. I hope you enjoy them. Well, thanks, dude. Ah, if I could, you wish to fly to our training hall, training hall, which might be useful for you. Alternatively, I could fly you to the tower. 
Um, fuck it, let's go to the training hall, let's see what this is about. Oh shit! Is this like a gym or something? Jeez, okay, I guess this is like a gym. So you've got a side pig, uh, that, I think it's part fire, I think, so I'm gonna switch out. I'm going to go for a surf. There we go, easy kill. And a mo holy shit! A Moltres? I'm gonna go into Gary for this, get him some experience. Rock Slide should be able to take this thing out pretty easily. Probably two hits. Oh, takes out in one. Very nice. I know it's I know it's double super effective, but uh, Gary's physical attack is not that great. But uh, hey, just took out a legendary bird, no problem. So, I guess we'll just fight all these dragons in here. So Clade all. That's not a good matchup. I'm gonna switch into Boober. He's gonna use Sandstorm. He has a pretty good special defense. I think I'm just going to go for a Water Spout. And a Whiskash. Uh, that is a job for a Grass type. You just touch these things with like a piece of fucking grass, they'll just die. Water Ground types, that is. Let's go for a Giga Drain. There we go. Easy kill. Critical hit probably didn't even matter. And a Sand Slash. Um, let's just stay in. Let's just go for Pedal Dance. So these, these guys seem to have a pretty varied, pretty varied teams, no specific type. Alright, so he's dead. Uh, let's flip this switch, I guess. So we got another dragon here. He's got a Kingdra. Okay, let's get the hell out of here. Uh, let's go into Crush. He's gonna use Bubble? Are you serious? That's it? Twister. Okay, so it's got some pretty weak moves. So let's just finish it off with a vital throw. Crush is level 55. Fuck yeah. Still does, still only has fighting moves, which is kind of annoying. Okay, that's nothing. Holy fuck, where am I going? <laughs> So, Aerodactyl, um, let's not take that on with Gary. Let's go into Boober. And let's just go for a Surf. Easy peasy. Skarmory, let's go, okay, let's go back into Gary. Throw some fire at that thing. And let's see, where do we go next? Um, okay, at least the same. Oh, but it's going down. Oh, fuck, I think we just got caught in it. What the fuck? Um... This is not... This is not... <laughs> I don't... Oh, uh, fuck. Let's go back down, I guess? Um... Okay, here's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna go back and heal up. Just cause... I want my PB back on my Pokemon. I'm going to restore the PP and I'm going to go back in there. Because I have a feeling there's going to be like a gym leader dragon. You know what I mean? Oh no, I didn't want to go to the tower. I wanted to go to... Uh, what is the tower even? But I want to Okay, I want to finish the hall first. So, I think we got to flip these switches again. Oh, let's flip this one. Come back here. Um... No, that's not where I wanted to go. Shit. Okay, Who's that one. I got that one down there too, I think. Uh, oh shit! Fuck! No, that's not what I wanted to do. God damn it! I gotta start over. Uh, okay, so let's come up here. Never mind. Holy fuck! Okay, um, this one. That. And no, that's not what I wanted to do. Fuck. Uh. No. I want to get back up there. No, that's not it. Fuck's sakes! God, this is... This is frustrating. Where in the... Okay. This is new. Meganium. Uh, that's a perfect matchup for me. I can just... Oh, that's going to light screen. Are you serious? But I am going to get the burn. That's nice. I need to use a safeguard right, right after I burn it. 
So he's dead. And fuck, is this like the gym leader? I don't know. So he's got an electrode. I don't think it's the gym leader, because he's only got two Pokemon. Um electrode, electrode. Let's go into Sanic. In case this thing wants to like explode or something, Sanic can take the hit, probably no problem. It's gonna start rolling out, so I can take those no problem. Even a even a fifth rollout I can take pretty easily. Let's just finish it off with another sand tomb. Booyah! And a Zapdos! Oh shit! Fuck, what do I wanna do? What do I wanna do to a Zapdos? That thing could oh fuck off, are you serious? Shit popping up on my computer. This is happening entirely too often, shit just popping up on the screen. Um, let's go... How about Gary? I'll rock slide it. Hopefully... Okay, so it's gonna use Drill Pack. Mm, I don't trust it with an electric move. I'm gonna go back in the Sanic. I'm going to slash it. I'm going to slash it again. And it's gonna die. Fuck yeah. So I'm going to just use a few Hyper Potions on my dudes. Get them back up to full. Um, okay, here's a switch. Who have I not fought yet? So run that switch. Oh, jeez. The gym leader would be the one there in the middle on that uh, fancy doohickey. The, fa the, the fancy ground. Oh, so I gotta make that thing just go up. So there's Got to be at least one more switch. It's that one there. Oh, it's that. I've gotten that one before, I think. How the fuck do I get back up there? Um, I gotta, I gotta get to the top somehow. Um, is this? There we go. Did that? Did that do it? Hell yeah! There we go. So. I'm guessing this is the gym leader, so here we fucking go. You de you returned my daughter to- oh, this is Meteor. You defeated the Four Horsemen, and now you have overcome the, power the, the powerful Six Element Dragons. I cannot begin to comprehend from where your spirit r arises, but I strive to emulate your warrior's heart. So, I guess we're gonna fight Meteor now. He's probably gonna be pretty strong. Probably pretty strong. He's got- oh shit, six Pokemon. He's gonna start off with a dragon. We fought one of these earlier in the game. Uh, I think it's just a dragon type. Um, let's go to Boober then. Let's ice beam it. It's gonna use scary face. That's annoying. It's gonna make me all slow now. Wing attack is gonna do like nothing at all. It's gonna take that ice beam amazingly though for a dragon type. Uh, Kingdra. All right, let's go. Let's go into Crush. Ice beams are gonna be neutral on that thing, so I'm, just, I'm gonna go into Crush instead. So let's go for oh fuck, it's gonna hyper po or max potion rather. So it's just gonna use agility as gonna be stupid, so I'll just go for a few battle throws. Another dragon. Uh let's go into Boober. I'm scared that the, the, that uh this thing's gonna have like a Salamence or like a Dragonite or something. Two ice beams is gonna take care of that though. Altaria. Let's just stay in and ice beam this thing. This should die. There we go. Another dragon. Real real creative name, I gotta say. <laughs> so, two ice beams, easy peasy, and another just dragon. Level 53 though. It's getting pretty it's getting stronger. It's gonna slash me and I'm just gonna finish it off with another ice beam. Boober for the for the win. I foresaw this. There's no way for a dragon to beat a trainer. For a trainer knight. Receive the Knight's Emblem from Meteor. Shit, is that like a badge or something? I've conferred upon you the title of Knight, because you are a warrior who surpasses even Draconic power. But that is not nearly enough. Take this too. TM2, right on. The Dragon Claw? Oh, fuck yeah, it's Dragon Claw. And of course, no one can learn it. I thought Sandslash maybe could have learned it. Any, uh, it would be a special attack anyway, though. So I guess we can just kind of GTFO. So she will... Yeah, let's return to the fort. Oh, we got a phone call. Hello? Yo, Hayden, this guy called Tones has just called me up from Lilico. The city's been 
flooded with zombies led by some weird guys. There's an old man, a man dressed in white and black, and a guy in a suit with blue magic beans. Gleason Temulence? You know them? We've crossed swords before. But that's not all. Hayden, Tones said he saw a swampert there fighting with zombies. So? Hayden, have you forgotten? That's your brother's signature Pokemon. Landon! Oh shit, our brother's there. Exactly. Get to Lily Cove as soon as possible. Oh shit, looks like we got ourselves a mission. Um, how are my Pokemon doing for levels though? Okay, here's the thing. Electrode is almost level 56 and Boober's almost level 55. I'm gonna hop into Victory Road real quick and just level grind them up. One level. We'll just spark this Hariyama. I would not have minded. I, I would have caught another Hariyama, honestly. Craig, or what was his name? I think I think I named my Hariyama Preggers. Uh, I think you. I think he would have been pretty good to have on the team again. I'll just surf this Laron, get up a level. Every little bit helps in this game. Oh shit! Another Hariyama. Oh fuck it! I'll just kill it. So, gotta heal up my dudes, and I think I'm gonna end the episode here. So in the next episode, we'll head back to Lily Cove, but first I want to check out what this tower thing is up above, uh, or what that uh, dragon can fly me to, so if you enjoyed this episode, of course, leave a like, leave a comment, and don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more on Pokemon Snakewood and other things Nintendo. I think we're getting pretty close to the end of this game, and I think it's gonna get pretty intense, so stick around. Alright, peace out guys, bye.